We are headed to a city that has been overtaken by burrows. Donkeys. That's a hook. That's a hook. everybody my name is Amy I'm a tangerine and we are on our way to historic Oatman Arizona and I can stand in the middle of the street because no one is here uh it's kind of a little weird to not have anyone around whatsoever life is ours uh, I cannot wait to show this town to you it really is overtaken by donkeys so let's go check it out about 10 miles to go. This, y'all, is historic Route 66. And this is the fun part of Route 66, where it really feels like Route 66. You know what I mean? This is old school. This is, no one is around. It's you, the dirt, and the mountains, and the animals, and it is fantastic. Getting here was quite the odyssey. The roads are really windy and curvy. And I feel like I'm in an episode of Left Behind. Like, listen. There is no one here but you and me. No one here. You and me. That was a snake. Okay. We're gonna be seeing that car on the side of the mountain later. Along our first donkeys. Hi guys. How are you? Oh, you're so pretty. Hi, baby. Oh says no junk food hay cubes only thank you two dollars to park just before the town here there's also like some spots that are free across the way there i just decided to park in the lot because this is easier dollars in the barrel in the barrel post office 
And the sign says, please do not feed donkeys on the porch, which tells me donkeys go on the porch. I already see a bunch of donkeys just chilling. It's cool. It's beautiful. And I think down here is probably the funnest ride. It's just hanging out everywhere. <laughs> I don't know what you're eating. <laughs> he's eating the Oh my gosh, he's eating the building. That can't be good for your teeth, dog. And we're off. Beautiful. Very. This one is very peaceful and calm. He's more chill than the other ones. He or she. She is more chill than the other ones. And he's going inside. He's like, I'm going shopping. I'm going shopping. <laughs> Coca-Cola. Trying to get into the Coca-Cola. I don't blame you. Like he's licking the Coca-Cola. That's funny. He got yelled at, but he came right back. Came right back. Just like my children doesn't listen. There's a gift shops here, and then right there is the Oatman Hotel where we're probably going to grab some lunch. Outlaw shows at noon and 2.15. High noon. The restaurant there. To do that. I plan to do that. <laughs> oh, I like this one. He's a little guy. The truth. <laughs> that was crazy. Need a shotgun wedding, right? Why not? Why not? He said it's been a week since he shot anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Mess around and find out. How many here for the first time in our little town? Anybody here first time? Let me know where you are. I want to see where you are. That's great. We ask that question because we get tired of shooting the same people all the time. <laughs> Boys, this is the town I was telling you about. I thought you said it was a town. You move all the way from there. But this town has got a Wells Fargo bank. Every town's got a Wells Fargo bank. <laughs> but the miners come down and put $20,000 in gold in it, and we're going to take it out. Now, wait a minute. We never robbed the bank before. It's only state coaches and trains. It's got to be easy. You know it's standing still. <laughs> Can be that hard, huh? Right. Okay, what's the plan? Got it. Uh -oh. We'll watch the people, you go in and get it. <laughs> That's a bad plan. Wait, I'm going to check this. How many think I can do it? Yeah! You can rob the bank. You can do it. Woo! <laughs> yeah! Black on the man. Rob the bank. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta run when you're out on the bank, y'all. <laughs> you, 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 you gotta, you gotta move. Where's your, where's your? The horse is up here. 
Next time we go to Old Mexico. But we're not going to Mexico. But we are. Oh, you can go. But the gold stays here. Ooh. Don't make me put a hole in you. Oh! Oh! Quit moving! Wait, Jim! Quit moving! Still want to keep the moving target? I'll share! You're gonna share? I'll share! I can't believe you double crossed me like that after all these years. Can't trust anybody anymore. Give me that kid over there where I keep an eye on you. Get up there. You know I wouldn't double cross you. Uh, oh, I sense a double cross coming. <laughs> I sense a double cross. <laughs> yeah. Wait a minute. I can't. I count the three. Cause you can't count the three. <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> Are you sure you want to do this? I feel lucky. On three. On three. One. <laughs> Two. Four. <laughs> Help us out. <laughs> that, was, that was so good. That was so good. It was so funny. This has been so fun. I love this. I was very nervous to come here because I have never been here. I didn't know what to expect, but this has been so fun. Oatman, Arizona. Who knew? It's the Alamo Odom restaurant and ice cream saloon. The town is named after Alamo Oatman, who was kidnapped and rescued after five years. So the town is named after her. <laughs> <laughs> Here, he grabbed this woman's bag of food. He just like grabbed a rimmer. He's like, mine, mine. <laughs> Down from the mountains there and come into the city and come right up to you. Oh, this is the little guy. A lot of food, but like, look at these mountains up here. They live in absolutely stunning official jail. It looks like people have been here for a while. That was built in 1936. I think I'd want to be in jail here. <laughs> Stayed a little too long, did you? Never got parole. I feel like you've stepped back in time. Honestly, it does feel like the olden times. The good old western days. stores where you can get all kinds of Oatman, Arizona, and Route 66 stuff. And those souvenirs, so we're just putting that in the car to come back for. Isn't that so cute? We love the donkeys. Charlie actually started the town of Oatman, which we found in 1895. The first mine was built in 1895. And in the last 10 years, thanks to the Gold Vortex Mining Company, two miles out on Silver Creek Walk, yeah. they donated $1,000 to St. Jude's through us a couple years ago, and with their help, we have now managed to donate $27,500 to the St. Jude's Research Hospital. We've also donated $2,000 to the Wounded Warrior, another $8,000 to some local charities. We donate to the bathrooms wow. and a few other things as well. And we've got some churches down in Port Mahoney. We help when they have family that have our financial need. Now, the way we do this, we're going to do a good Yeah, this is a highway robbery. <laughs> don't make me shoot in the foot. Anything we don't use for powder and primers and things we need for doing a show, we donate something who needs it. Now, speaking of robbery, uh, we want to mention before we get started, you see them two big old ladies down there? One's named April, Pearl. the other one's named Nick. Now, what they are doing is they're sitting there <laughs> ignoring you. But don't, if you have bags in your hand or bags around you, hide them or hold them very close to you and do not swing to one side or another to get it away from them because what they're doing is one's on one side playing with you, the other one is 
on the other side waiting for you to turn her direction. But then she's going to get your bag and take it from you. They're the best bag thieves in town, and they are just sitting. They just seem peaceful, but that's not what they're doing. They're sitting there waiting for us to start going. Start Double team you. Anyway, so be careful. Just like in Detroit. Burrows, all the birds, but especially those two. Those two are the worst of the bunch. Wait. Anytime you get a bank full gold, the sheriff is going to guard you. And that guy's in there. That's us. It's us. And it's gun back time. Time to shoot somebody. Ooh, yay. Best time of the right. day. This here is that town I tell you about. All right. I like it. Look, come here a week ago. Wait for a stagecoach. Show us some gold on it. And I found you one, too. Got wind of him coming into town. He had two bags of gold on him. <laughs> yeah, he parked, he parked right there. Ooh, ooh, right here? Oh, uh, yeah, he was right oh, there. Oh, boy, did you get to rob it? No, I didn't get to rob him. Rob if I'd have robbed him, why would we be here today? Hey, I didn't think of that. I didn't ride all this way for nothing. No, I couldn't rob him because while he was parked there, I was stuck in that outhouse. Oh, no. You're <laughs> <laughs> Me too. I mean, this town's hoarding all the toilet paper. Oh, can't yeah, right. yeah. not right. <laughs> I couldn't Facts. find a Sears and Robot catalog. Couldn't even find a stray cat. I'd have ruined a good pair of socks to get out of there. Yeah, do that. He did the bike. One of us got to go rob it. Which is why I brought you two here today. Which one of you two going to go rob Whoa. that bank? Well, uh, I never robbed the bank. The head coach and train my bank. I stole not lady one time. You go yeah. through the door, there's a little old lady sitting at a desk in there. It says, tell her on it. Walk up to her, give her a nice smile, be polite about it. Say, give me your money. She gives it to you and you walk out. Whoa, hey, did you see that? You pretty good, Dan, ain't you? You got a point. Why don't you go in? Yeah. Yeah, I'm still a little leery about going through bank room doors right now. Last time I went through one was down in Yuma, and I forgot to check the post office, didn't realize my poster was there, and uh -huh. I walked through the door, they didn't say hands up, give up, nothing. They just started shooting me. Whoa. I still got holes in my coat. Gee, I'm leery about going through bank bummer. doors, which is why I brought you two here today. Huh. I ain't going in there. I won't go in there. No, you got nothing to worry about. I already checked the post office here. They don't know who we are. You get shot I don't hurts. know. Yeah. Well, one of us got to go in there. Well, we figure out some way when I was going there and be fair. How's that? All right. We'll be fair about it. Well, we'll play a game, and the one who loses the game is going to go rob the bank. I like that. that. Yeah, that'll fair. work. I like that. What uh, kind of game are we going to play? Uh, I don't know. We'll play that rock, paper, scissors type I like yeah, that one, yeah. That yeah. You got you ready? I'm, I'm good at this. One, two, go rob the bank. <laughs> he wins. Yeah, gun beats rock, paper, and yes, gun wins. Here. I apologize. I thought that game worth 27 cents anyway. 28 now. 28. Woo! Woo! <laughs> he keeps stealing candy from that teacher. He's going to be worth something someday. Hey, where's he going? I thought he was going in the bank. Oh, no way. Money. Uh, All the money. <laughs> Come on, now you hand it over. Wait. Wow. Like I'll start hats. shooting. Like two hats. You can't get nothing out of that. Why not? It says all the money right uh, on the it. The old man down the street said that thing won't talk to you unless you got a bank account and a card with a bunch of numbers on it. I didn't bring one of them. Yeah, they don't give things like that to people like us. No. So go in there and rob it like I told you. All right. Go check your ass out. Yeah, I don't like yeah. bank robbers. <laughs> ain't nothing ain't lower than a bank robber's a politician, isn't it? <laughs> they rob everybody. They use computers to do it. They don't just rob banks, they rob everybody. Oh. Oh, get out of here! She's gonna put the knots on your head with the broom handler shooting over here. It's a mean town. <laughs> it's a mean town. <laughs> what happened to you? That old man over there. I grabbed your saddlebag, turned around to see what was going out here, and that turned around, he had a gun pointed at me. Oh. I had to shoot him. You want to fight over saddlebag? Yeah, why was he so upset about the saddlebag? Oh, Gotta be gold. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, <laughs> I ain't gold, but I did find the one hoarding all the toilet paper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. <laughs> he got six rolls in here. I'm going to oh, go shoot him again. <laughs> All right, they're going to help. Yay. Now, the way y'all can help, when you hear both of us say we're ready, y'all holler, draw real loud, then I'm going to shoot him a whole bunch. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wait a minute. I don't think that's right. No, hey, that ain't right. No. What? Oh, he's standing behind a woman. <laughs> he's standing behind a woman. Oh, that's hilarious. 
Oh, the donkey's gonna help. Oh, now you're in real trouble. Let him in open now. Now you're in real. <laughs> He's hiding behind the donkeys. Mark you out of that. I'm ready. I'm ready. No. What would you shoot me for? <laughs> well, apparently you missed. No, he didn't miss. I've never seen one go that far. Are you using Walmart bullets again? Oh, yeah. yeah. Walmart bullets. Oh. They don't go straight. Walmart bullets. Hey, yeah, that, that is funny. He's not here. Oh, now. Oh, no. Uh -uh. I'm mad now. Oh. <laughs> Got another way of doing it. Nice. Yeah, you got to catch the tree. Three. Yeah, three. Oh yeah, I'm counting three. Oh. Alright, you can't three because on three I'm gonna shoot. Okay. Oh wait a minute, wait a minute. I gotta check this out. This is three? Three. Yeah. Alright, the expert here says that is three. I can ah. get that far. Here we go. Ow! Dose. Dose. Wait a minute. What? Oh. What's in the dose thing? What are you talking about? Oh, I forgot. I'm going down to Mexico, and that's the way they talk down there. <laughs> yeah, down there. Look, only thing I know how to say down there is masa base of pork before. I don't know that. Tequila from a scout. Just need more beer, please. No, oh. oh. You speak English, so I can understand what we're saying. All right, up here's English. Here we go. One Mississippi. Two Mississippi. Wait a minute. Now what? You don't even know where you're at. We ain't Mississippi. We ain't in Arizona. He's got a point. Yeah, yeah, you got a point. Hey, you're so cantankerous. You do the count. I count. I turned great seven times. Ooh, got a scholar here. <laughs> I'm ready. One Arizona. I like it. Two Arizona. Arizona. Oh, I like him. He said three. <laughs> Sometimes they come back. Yeah, check. What do you want next? Well, I got to thinking. I'll figure out how to get the big bag. Look what thank you did for him. <laughs> well, I think I can think a little bit better at thinking than him, I think. <laughs> hey. well, I think so. What makes you think that you ought to get the big bag? I went in there and robbed it. I told you the goal was that. Yeah, but I did all the work. Work. He was shooting bullets at me. All you did was go scare some little old lady. That ain't what happened at all. There was a crazy lady in there with a broom. Who the fuck y'all go up in Arizona? You guys have a great day. God bless. Yay. Yay. That was awesome. All right. It has been an incredible day here in Omen. I have had the best time, which is, is crazy, right? Like, I go to Disney World and Disneyland all the time. And... You can have fun and experiences that are just as good as traditional entertainment. And Oatman has been amazing. I've had the best time. Can I help you? <laughs> I'm just like standing here. May I help you? All right, not gonna lie, the restrooms are interesting. Let's just put it that way. Interesting. Oh, it's really dark in here, but here is the menu. Can't really see anything in here. They have those dollar bills all over the walls. Literally, dollar bills everywhere. It's not often that you're eating and there's a gunfight going on right outside. That's a new one for me. I'm just covering all the walls because the miners just write their names on it and then tape them here and then use the dollar to buy liquor, which was like five cents for like a beer. This is the Gable Lombard Honeymoon Suite. See that Clark Gable and Carol Lombard honeymooned here. And this is the room that they stayed in. I thought Jai brought on the John would do this. <laughs> oh, no, here it is. I asked him if he wanted to do a t shirt. He said no. This was their honeymoon. Their marriage is. 
day in the And Arizona is elevation 2,700 feet. <clears throat> and they said the burrows first came to open with early day prospectors. The animals were also used inside mines for hauling rock and ore. Hauling water and supplies. As the mines closed and people moved away, the burrows were released into the surrounding hills. Watch the movie Back to the Future. This is kind of like, kind of giving me that feel like, like you're in the Back to the Future movies. It's, it's so good. You know, the one where he goes back in time and Doc Brown was in the Wild Wild West. You know what this feels like? Diego, Diego, get your ears up. Diego, get your ears up. <laughs> Look at me, you all. I am a Nevadian. I have gone full Nevada, Arizona. <laughs> Can you believe that I'm from Florida and I'm like hanging out in a town? with donkeys. Life is so strange. Life is so strange, y'all. I would have never predicted this, but here we are. I love this store because she feeds them very well. And then they have like, I don't know if it's a salt block or like water on the, on the porch there. This is like, they like to hang out at her shop. This is the cool place in town, right here. This is where it's happening. The candy shop. Look at that. They've got all kinds of goodness. Goodness. Water heavy. <laughs> I put my candy in my backpack because during that gun show, one of these donkeys like just nabbed one of these ladies' bags and just like took it from her. It was so funny. Thing that you can go into. This is very cool. Yes. <laughs> Am I going to see Jesus? It's like a confessional. Like I must tell all truth under this light. All right. I'm gonna confess to. Don't tell anybody. Oh, what's the crime you ask? Well, let me tell you. Oh, did the video get cut off? That's weird. That doesn't usually happen. Seriously. <laughs> you want ice cream? You want ice cream? Oh, this one wants ice cream too. I'm being left out because I have this. <laughs> A line of donkeys wanting my ice cream. I'm not supposed to have ice cream because of my gastroparesis, but y'all, when in Rome. Like, how could you not? Look at this. How can you not? Say goodbye to the burrows. Bye, buddies. We'll see you again soon. I will be back again. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Why are you on my porch? <laughs> Come in now. You all want to go in here? It's a line of donkeys that want to go in here. They want to go see the jail. All right, that'll do it for today's video. I love Oatman, Arizona. My favorite part had to have been the gun show and of course the donkeys hanging out with one right here uh what a great day what an amazing town it's just so nice it's just so nice you got to come here sometime and experience it for yourself so thanks for watching and until we meet again it's been fun let's do oatman arizona again My mom is a little weirdo. Look at her. Animal in the zoo.